almost fell right into the exact same situation as my brothers and who have done time in prison and my biological mom who was a teen mom and you know obviously all the other things I was two seconds from being in that exact same spot it took that small village that started with Department of Social Services stepping in and making sure I was safe then it took you know, CASA stepping in and giving me Joan, and then Family Care Network once I turned 16 with the Independent Living Program, and then TAFAP, and you know, it took everyone just little, just circling around me to like really get me to realize my potential and see that I didn't have to end up like that. I want all of our youth to know that they can have that too, and you know, we need the community to step up and to know that like there are foster youth in this county and. They're not going anywhere. And we need that support. They need that support more than anything because how else are they gonna know that they matter? How else are they gonna know that, you know, they are resilient, amazing young youth that can reach the stars if educationally, financially, we need to have mentors. We we need the village. If we're not there to uplift, empower, encourage, support, and just teach them all of those different things about life and that their future can hold whatever they want it to and be there to support them along that way, I mean, chances are they're going to go back to where it's comfortable.